shoot us out. That's why he came back in the classroom and all. But he kind of figured bad about what he said. He kind of hung it down a little bit. No, he just got some wind. He came back and got another bite up for sale. And I said, whoa. I told him, I said, one thing I learned in service school is a suit, you have a suit, you have a pants, and a coat match. And so, <laughs> and of course, they had a lot of things. We had a lot of fun. Do you ever do you remember anything in particular? Did you ever have a, a suspect or a violator that you would arrested or something? Did you ever have somebody do something that you know that used to be a deal on TV called the most stupid criminals? Or do you do you, or, do you ever remember anything just something kind of crazy or nutty or funny that any of your suspects? You know, I had a suspect one time. Really, not funny, but the serious offense we're looking at this guy had sexually molested the child by. You. And we really had no physical evidence or anything. And the police department had called me about it. And we met with the guy and got him in. We're interrogating him in my office. And I was getting on him pretty hard when we were interrogating him. And I'm making him mad. He kept denying it. And for instance, like this offense maybe occurred in January. I can't remember the exact date now. But, you know, the guy said, Finally, he jumped up and looked at me. He said, I didn't do that in January. He said, I did in November, though. <laughs> and, and I got him to give me a written statement. I said, well, we'll come back to January. Then. I'm going to take care of this right now. I'm just going to keep your poker face on. You don't tell him he just hooked me. 